Hello and welcome to Mint Talk India. We are studying NCERT class 5th EVS chapter 2 a snake charmer story and this is part 2. In part 1 we have discussed about the life of Kalbelias. Now let's go to the next topic. Here are some questions for you and you have to write the answers from your own experience. Have you ever seen animals being used for entertainment of people? When and where did you see this? So usually I am sure most of the children have seen animals being used in circus or in bullock carts or in tonga like in circus which on animals can we see we can see tigers elephants birds dogs and they do various kind of acts and entertain people people also use bullocks to pull bullock carts in villages and they also use horse to pull the tonga or the horse cart in any fair also we can see camel elephants horses and people take camel ride elephant ride and they get entertained they feel happy so these kind of animals are being used for the entertainment of people okay now tell me if you have seen such animals then how did people behave with the animals in the show or anywhere else where you have seen sometimes we can see people are very nice they give something good to eat but sometimes we can also see that the owner of the animal usually beats the animal when the animal is not obeying the instructions properly so this is little bad to see then next question is was anyone teasing the animal teasing means to trouble an animal like throwing any bottle throwing any paper ball or anything bad towards the animal and troubling the animal like this have you seen next question is what kind of questions come to your mind after seeing the animal show imagine that you are also an animal in a cage think how would you feel just like how this lion is looking so sad he must be feeling that i was free in jungle i could roam around here and there whenever i wanted but now i am trapped in this cage i can't go anywhere as per my wish my freedom is lost so complete the following sentences according to the thinking if you were an animal in a cage when you would have felt afraid what would you have wished when would you have felt sad if you would have a chance what would you have done etc next we will study about the most important topic of this chapter that is about most poisonous and deadliest snakes found in india as we have already discussed in part 1 all the snakes are not poisonous There are only four type of snakes which are most dangerous and they can kill people within seconds. So let's study how to recognize them. First is cobra. Cobra is the longest and poisonous snake found in India. It is found it is mostly found in rain forests where it rains a lot. Cobra is mostly black in color but its color can vary from place to place like from country country to country its color can change next is common crate common crate is the most deadliest snake among the four poisonous snakes in india its body is brown or black in color with white stripes all over so you can easily identify common crate it is very easy to identify because of the design on its body third is russell's viper or it is also called duboya in hindi these snakes are also light colored or grayish brown in color it has oval shaped spots on its whole body and russell's viper is also very easy to identify just see how beautiful the pattern is there on its body but it is very dangerous also fourth one is saw scaled viper it has dry looking body as it is mostly found in rocky and dry places it has light colored round patches on top of its body with wavy lines around the spots 
So this is saw scaled viper. Next is another question for you like the snake charmer which other people depend on animals. So as you can see already two answer are written. Farmers depend on bullocks to plow the his field. Washerman depends on donkeys to carry loads of cloth. Similarly, milkman also depends on cows and buffaloes as he milks the cow and he sells the milk and earn money. Similarly, poultry farm also depends on hen. We get uh, eggs from the poultry and then eggs are sold and the poultry owner earns money. Did you know that medicines which are given to people for snake bite those medicines are also prepared by snake venom venom means the snake poison only so the snake's venom is taken out just like how you can see in these pictures and then the venom is sent for research and medicines are prepared out of this so amazing no there is one more interesting thing to know about is nag gumphan nag means snake gumphan means design this is a rangoli kind of design used by people of gujarat and south india in this design snakes are drawn on floor as a rangoli or printed on clothes or embroidery is done on clothes in the form of this kind of design so this is nag gumphan so here we have finished our chapter 2 if you have any doubts feel free to write in the comment section we will meet very soon to study chapter 3 till then take care and god bless you all Thanks for watching and do like share subscribe our channel Mint Talk India for more upcoming videos